what I found on eBay, it goes, it's ranging from like five to 2,000. I paid a grand. Both of these were priced at 25 each. $25? Yeah. <laughs> oh my God. They didn't know what they had. Oh. There you go. So that's a lot of Terminators. Struggling to put a new guys in. Please, please tell me that the code name for that classified mode is Dastardly Pet. Yeah. <laughs> Well, normally they're all authors. That is great. I, I think that might be the first one that I've noticed that isn't a famous author, right? Dastardly pet. I'll buy that for a dollar. Matt's coming in. Yeah. Guy who built all the giant He-Mans. He's got a bunch. I forget the story, and he might be able to explain it better, but it's the... Uh, what, what was the company? Do you remember? Was it Chronicle? Or? I think Chronicle was the name of it. They, they had the Terminator license and made giant... Endoskeletons, life-size Terminator, busts. Yeah, it was... But he's bringing me... I don't know however he got them or what the story was before the company went out of business. He did a big purchase. So they're these giant endoskeletons. They're from Genesis, which I don't think is one of the more popular Terminators. It wasn't bad. Yeah. But it's a traditional endoskeleton, so... It works. But he's bringing like 30 of them. So it's going to be a big load. So, as you know from Retro, he's doing one of every He-Man piece upsized. And these are three rare pieces in that line that he had purchased to upscale. And then I guess he didn't, he couldn't quite, it'd be a shame to open these if all he needs is them loose to scan and upscale. And I was like, well, I need these in my collection because I don't have these. So I bought these from him. And then he said, all I ask is you find them all loose and complete so he could scan them and upscale them. So I bought these already. And I did pick up this one, which I will give to him today. So this, which one is this? Tower Tools? Uh, or no, the Climber. Cliff Climber? Cliff climber yeah. yeah, so this one. No, no, it says Tower Tools. Cliff Climber is the one that goes over the shoulder uh, and okay. man at arms in the commercial, right? Yeah, I, it's hard to remember those. Right? Yeah, these are all tough. Most of these were only released, what is it, in Spain or, yeah, yeah just. Got, yeah, I think the line kind of went south here. So, I got two more to go that I need to pick up for him, but I think he'll be happy that I at least got one of them. Giants never made it here. Oh, yeah. No, the Giants are nice. Every time I see them with a package, though, the package is just destroyed. Yeah. Like it's... I think it's just so much window. So before we finish this episode, I wanted to tell you something that's a first for the channel. We have our first sponsor. And before I tell you who that sponsor is, got to give you a little backstory. So I get asked at least 10 times a day, will you ship this? Why don't you ship? I saw this in an episode, would you ship it to New Jersey or wherever? And I always say we don't ship, you know, Disney World doesn't come to you. So when this sponsor reached out, who's whatnot, and they were telling me about the platform and the unique opportunity where I could communicate with you, the viewer, you know what, maybe this is the perfect opportunity for me and you to be able to obtain items that we featured in the show. So this episode sponsors Whatnot. And the unique thing about Whatnot, if you're unfamiliar with them, is it's an online live streaming selling platform that you download on your phone and people sell collectibles, buy collectibles, and they're running a Whatnot Con April 11th through the 14th. It's gonna feature over 1,200 exhibitors, over 20 different comic and toy exclusives. And we will be involved on that Friday, April 12th at 8 p.m. There's a link down below, make sure you bookmark it. It's going to have unique sections for toys, video games. They're gonna have special guests, over 20 different comic and toy exclusives that are unique just to this event. It doesn't cost to enter. There's no lines to wait in. Whatnot's giving $10 off the first purchase. Just sit at home and check out your favorite creators. There's gonna be a pinned comment down below 
where you bookmark our live and we're going to make available crazy unique items that have been in some of the previous episodes. So for example, everybody's been talking about this thing. It's going to become available. Uh, but you know, whether it's, I know we've showcased uh, my buddy in Argentina who sends me bootleg turtles. We're going to have bootleg turtles available. Uh, there was those cheesy bootleg 18 figures. We're going to have those available. And then there were those really cool masters of the universe books that were minty. We're going to make those available. And then got a lot of phone calls to ship this. So now here's your chance. Great a jet fire. Don't miss it. The whole gang's going to be there. I'll be there. Andy will be there. Travis will be there. I even think I got Devin coming. So it's going to be special. Hang out with us. We're going to go as long as we can and get some of these cool things featured on the show. And now back to the video. What's going on, man? I need your help. Oh, he broke something. No, no. I found something. The other. Uh, okay. Five bucks. Found two things. Five bucks? Yeah. You know what? We talked about this. Wait, wait, wait. If it's not. 250. If it's not oh, cold cash, I don't want to. I'm, I'm tired. tired of this. <laughs> What's he got? Yeah. Spanx rewards. We'll, 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 seriously, what kind of shop are you running that we don't offer <laughs> cold cash, dude? They eat that letters. I'm hoping yeah. in, <laughs> in a few months There's is my Shadow goal. Ninja. So I found that. This is where I need your help. I also found this guy. Oh, oh the Plasterama. Plasterama. Yeah, no, that's nice. Silver yeah. weapon I have, from what I found on eBay, it could, it's ranging from like five to 2,000. No idea what it, how much it actually costs. I mean, I, I actually have. I bought one that's um, hello, honey. Maybe slightly better. Yeah. And I paid a grand. Yeah. So they're, they're good. It's a good piece. Yeah. Well, because you can't afford the vintage one now, or at least. Well, no, no, but I mean, good. Tony just sold his vintage but, one for like, under two grand. Yeah. But I've never seen an 83 vintage in package. Yeah. Since I was a kid. Now, where did you find this? Uh, really? They priced, both of these were priced at 25 each. <laughs> $25? Yeah. <laughs> oh my God. They didn't know what they had. Um, they also may be contacting you guys because they have a lot of G1, GI Joe stuff that they don't know how to price and they don't know what's missing. Like the USS Flag, the Space Shuttle. Oh, wow. The, the good thing about the foreign ones, too, is they didn't yellow. Yeah, American they didn't. American. There's different plastic. So, same thing with the Chinese version. They don't, for some reason, there's an additive, or Travis could probably speak better on plastic than I could. Yeah, I no, know. but they tend to, just the card's degrade. a lot weaker. And the Cobra logo is bigger, too, on the, <clears throat> the shoulder. So, what do you want, so 50 like bucks? <laughs> No, we're talking about Coles this. Five dollars Coles cash, dude. You, Coles cash? Yeah, yeah Coles seriously. Yeah, I'll give you a gift certificate of dollies, and you can get all the clearance Hasbro stuff. <laughs> Thanks. I get that Dungeons and Dragons stuff that uh, Target's trying to get out of here. Yeah, no, this is a great. No, game. I wasn't even sure I wanted to sell it. I just didn't know. Yeah, I no, just, it's, it's a key piece. Yeah, I mean, I, it, uh, I just knew what I. They were more than what I bought them for, but other than what I could find on eBay, I had no idea anything about them. I'd say carded for him. He's like forty dude. Yeah, he's not so much. Yeah. Oh, no. But he's still cool. I just yeah. thought it was cool because I've never seen color change. Oh, yeah. Hot like water, cold water? Yeah. yeah. Yeah, the Shadow Ninjas? Yeah. yeah. And the Eco Warriors, they had the color change. Yeah. Uh, what, uh, you no, did? the color change was the entire reason I picked him up. Yeah. Not because I no. thought it was valuable. No. But no. Like, no, you're, you're 25 bucks. That's nuts, man. Hey. Well. Sounds like I need to make a trip. <laughs> <laughs> they got a bunch. Of, they, ha they do have some Japanese... Um, G.I. Joe's because they just listed it on their Facebook page three days ago. Oh, like the Takaras? Yeah. yeah. You've got I, most of it. Yeah, yeah. I, I think I don't have... I'm missing like one or two. Right? I picked up Firefly. Okay. Uh, but I don't have Snake Eyes or, you know, because those are the ones that run money. That's cool. Yeah, you know, they, they had all the G.I. Joe's priced at 25 So I think they just basically just saw it. Well, you should go back and buy them all and then I'll buy them for you. Make some money. Give me some gas money. <laughs> That's great. Let me see. Gas money when I can get more credit cash. and buy more stuff here. A giant Max Steel. Yeah. I don't know, what, two and a half feet or two feet or 
I didn't know this existed. I just learned about it the other day. A guy brought it in. And so I think this came out in 1985. It retailed for $600. So I don't know what that is in today's money, but like 1500 2000 I don't know. But I don't know what kid could afford this in 85 $600 when the flag was like 109 bucks or 119 bucks. But they only made, so I did some research. They only made 5000 Uh I mean, it's missing the remote. But when the guy showed me a picture of it in his barn, I was like, I definitely want it. It's just something I've never seen, and I just think it's super cool. But the only thing I could find is some commercial for it, for Alphabet Soup, that if you entered something in, you could win this. And they gave 50 away. But then I was talking to somebody who was telling me there's really cool websites dedicated to this, where they rebuild them, how to repair them. But it had a computer, so like a CPU inside, and it actually could learn up to 250 words. Like you could teach it a song, and it would, you know, it, it was state of the art for the time. But so. I just don't know who could afford $600 in 85 for a kid. So, but supposedly when they got bought out, or whenever Ideal went out, or it was CBS, somewhere in the story I read that most of these got destroyed. So. They didn't sell that well. And then, you know, his arms would go up, and then this would rotate, and you could pick up stuff. And I don't... I don't really... I mean, I think it was going to, at one point, get cassettes that you plugged into it, which I don't think it ever got to that stage. I could be wrong. Wait for me. Thank you. Begin game. You are out. It's the Alphabet's Robot Instant Winner Game. Millions will enter. Fifty kids win. Or you. If you look inside specially marked boxes of Post Alphabet cereal for two laser stickers, one could say you win a max steal. Or for free entry, write Box 1740, New York, New York. I like you. Would not throw a baseball at it. I know. You're right. <laughs> one time you throw it. Hey, so I do have one thing you... I mean, I haven't finished the task, but... Oh, nice, you got one. There's one of them. Sweet. All right, so we have to scan those. So that's tower, tower tools? Tower tools. Yeah, Cliff Climber's the other one. And see, yeah. All right. To get it from Germany. I mean, I'm all... I keep looking, because I'm trying to get it in a... In a, yeah, we'll, uh, a reasonable... We'll scan it, we'll scan it and get it back to you. Yeah, cool. Not like a perfect system, but it's like... Definitely appreciate it. And then I got big truck full of terminators for you yeah, yeah that's what he was saying who made these again was it chronicle chronicle, chronicle collectible okay so then i got it right as far as i understand they're not in business anymore right like, that's I what i thought the owner he was a nice guy he um i met him at a convention and then he wanted to unload like a bunch of overstock that he wasn't selling anymore so yeah, i went yeah. into his warehouse and he has like this huge like movie museum. Like oh, that's right. You the, were telling me that. All the original predators and like the, the, movie the robot from Judge Dredd with Stallone. Like that. Yeah. Movie. I would this love to. Um, I don't know what happened. I just looked at his website. It says some sort of <laughs> lawyer statement saying that they're no longer in business. Oh wow. So yeah. Look at all this activity. Look at look at all these cars at Toy Federation. This is great. They're everywhere. All the way down. <laughs> it's nuts. There you go. That's a lot of Terminators. So they all fill in two boxes for one. So they only made 500 then, right? If this is case I, count 250? Yeah, I don't, I'm guessing. That's you know I mean? my... And they're numbered on the box, so... Yeah, 147 out of 500. All right. We're going to open this up. It's going to be broken into a million pieces. Yeah, I don't want broken ones. <laughs> I'll give you this. I doubt they're broken. I'd seen your members in a giant styrofoam. Yeah. Or... Well, well, they're made of plastic. Well, they're like a plastic kind of, you know. Thing. Oh, right. It had the, the four. Yeah. So it'll be fine. But even if it's snapped or something, it's usually out like a seam where you can okay. fix it. Yeah, well, we got it from previously, so top on the corner. Okay.
Yeah, it used to be up yeah. in that corner. Yeah. So I'll walk on them. Uh, so now we gotta, gotta open that door. And then we gotta cut it. Was there writing on the other side? I didn't see any writing. Okay. Uh oh. -uh. Toy Federation. And there we go. Oh, that's right. Oop. Oh, I just got something. Oh, did you? Oh, yeah. You gotta be careful. You can break it. Though. I don't know, but I think it shifts. Travis will glue that. I think I grabbed it and messed it up. <laughs> so it's cold. It's been in a cold storage. So let's not stretch any of this until it warms up a little Cyberdyne bit. Cyberdyne systems? So, yeah. Yeah, mm -hmm. I did that grabbing it. It's our floor Did model. It just pop out it's a floor, floor model. It's the floor model. So, yeah. Once we sell all thirty of them, then we sell this one last. That's an easy fix. You just oh no, it's but a little bit of glue. Nobody. It's a, it has a set of oh, the I see. Seams. Yeah, yeah but when I grabbed it and pulled it, so that's on me. And then he had this crazy rail gun, or whatever you call it. It's a really nice endoskeleton. Yeah. It has that gun metal, also, so you can put. Um, oh, so it lights up. Yeah, it lights up. You can put. Let me show you something. Take it off. Put your batteries in there, and then oh, yeah. you oh, can cool. just click it on, and the eyes light up. Bump, 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 bump. Oh, so grab that foot and kind of slip it in there. Well, not going in. I have to. Thank you. There you go. This helps out a lot because now we have uh, yeah. room to put all of our Masters of the Universe stuff because yeah, you need like, space. <laughs> yeah, we're running out of space. We have like so much coming in. And it's fine if you don't want these. These are just ones that if you, you know, I was thinking store credit for the Guardians. Now what's a Guardian? That's the old man Terminator. Oh, that's right. Uh, yeah, no, uh, it's, it's oh, the box is in this one. Okay. Sweet. Right. All right. Now this is used. I don't know the condition. Just little heads, little little heads up here. This isn't like, oh, uh, yeah. like I know what's happening. There we go. Okay. I know one of them, one of the ones I had, we have to drill the the yeah. hole a little deeper because the thing doesn't go all the way down. So that oh, little hole has to go a little deeper. It might not be this one. You could try to stick them in there so you can stand. Yeah, that one works. So it's supposed to be the other one. Now you have a couple hand options. You got that one and then you have another hand that has that electrode thing in the movie. I don't know if you remember the movie. He was on a bus and he has like electric electricity hand. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. All right. So now should I move it next to the other one? Sure. Yeah, I like uh, uh I like uh Brain or well, that one I'll keep out. I can look at it. What other licenses did this company have? Do you oh, know? they had like they had almost everything. Because he worked in the industry. He was a he was a special effects artist. He had like he had everything. He had like he had uh, Jurassic Park. He had um, ooh, David, be excited, Connor. He had Conan. Like he did a Conan one. It's pretty. It's like King Conan him sitting on the throne. Oh, that's cool. But yeah. was it Arnold? Yeah, the Arnold it was Arnold, one? yeah. Oh, wow. You can't even get it now for under 3000 like, if you could find it. That's the way it looked at the end of the movie? Yeah. The yep. Where he's, like, kneeling on his chin, or...? Mm -hmm. Wow. It's really heavy. So he offered me, like, 150 of these. And I just didn't have the money at the time. And, wow. like, some of them were signed by Schwarzenegger. And I was like, oh, man, <laughs> like, oh, I was so bummed I didn't have that money. So here you go. That's it. Yeah, that's cool. And his eyes do light up. Might be. Oh, yeah. There you go. Look at that. Yeah. Mm. 
Do you want it? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> make them work. Make them work for it. <laughs> That's cool. Well, I didn't. I didn't tell him about this one. So if you want it, you can, it's it's all yours, man. You well, just... I presented the deal. I can't. I can't yeah, well, it's swoop rules. in. It's Ryan's rules. It's too late. It's in my store. Yeah. Let's use your store. <laughs> right, there you go. Yeah. That's the button. All right. And I love when it shuts off. Like, oh yeah. It fades. Yeah. Yeah. It's pretty great. It's gotta be dead. That's the last one. Uh, I like the All right, I'm gonna plasma right. I like the skin texture on that. So it looks good. Yeah, no, this is like. I guess you almost wonder if he had all this licensing yeah, now put this out, he'd probably crush it. Maybe. You wonder how it just didn't work out. I, I don't know. I can't even begin to guess. I'm, I'm assuming he got over. Or maybe too many licenses all at once. And yeah, I think much. he just. I think he just got overwhelmed with everything, and then they just they had to shut it down. Like, shut it all so. down. So the thing we already know was is him. And then there's just one of each of these. Oh, no, there's two of them. So two of that, one, one, and one. I, I have no idea of value. Okay. I know the battle damage one looks like it's pretty high in value, but the one that's full face is not. That one's cheap. And then I don't know about the one, one scale. I don't know what that is. Um, so Chronicle? Chronicle Collectibles, Terminator Genesis, one, one scale, head, like endoskeleton. Somebody is selling that. Oh, well, they are. So how much? Seven hundred. Okay, that makes sense. That's yeah. That's what they're. Yeah. That's the only. I I can't find a sold of that. I did see solds of this. Mm -hmm. That one's like two something. But then that. Yeah. How much is that going for? Somebody paid five seventy five yeah. for that. That makes sense. Yeah. That's really. Uh. And then, but I, I can't, I, I can't find, find that, one. that one. I can't find that either. I find it for sale for like almost a thousand. Oh, so let me do worth point. Because in the big scheme, the production runs are very tiny. Right. So it's not like there's a lot of these. So if I do, and what did they call the Arnold's? Uh, Guardian. Are you talking about these Bust. Uh, let me just type bust, right? Because yeah. I want to find this. Right. One half scale bust. Okay, and if I go sold date most recent. And that guy lost his butt. Yeah, he did. Jeez. But then that guy got that. 650. How long was that? October? Yeah. So that's about average. I would say that's right. Between six and seven. Is about accurate for, for the, the battle damage. For the other one, I don't think people really care about it. I mean, that's 2021, so there's right. not a lot of activity. That, that, was the, that was the recent one. Right. So then, uh, so I'd say there's roughly $2,000 in retail. Okay. Well, but you're not selling those, right? So, I wouldn't. Like these you'd sell. The, I was thinking. I wouldn't I sell these. Was, so what I was thinking was store credit for these two. Okay. And then for these. Yeah, just what do you want? Make me a good offer. So what do we say? That one's, I could buy that. What was it? Brand, used for seven. So I think that's a fair value. Yeah, for that. seven, that's yeah. retail. This was like three. Yeah, that's, that's not This one was like five. Was it five? Like five seventy five or something? Or what was it? No, I thought it was more than that. It was six something. Hold on. Could be. It could be more. Yeah. Oh no, six forty nine. Yeah, yeah. So six fifty. New in box. New in box. So there's a little bit. It's a little bit. It's Some guy wants to be the guy to open it. Sure, sure. Versus, but, but yeah. So all right. So say six three and so three and seven is a grand. So let's say there's sixteen hundred dollars. Okay. Is what. It would be worth if I were to sell it, which right. I'm not. But right. so, what is it worth to you? Uh, not selling it and keeping it for yourself. Well, I always have a buyer's. You know, my brain is like a, uh, a thousand. I had to go up just a little bit for me. 
Just a little bit. I would say 1200 It's almost retail. Almost. Uh, but that's cash or is that that's, trade? That's cash. Trade would be this Whoa. game. Oh. We're talking about these three right now. Right? No, I know. Yeah, okay. But it's worth $1,600. Right. But I get it. If I'm going to keep it, I'm not reselling it. I mean, that's fair. Cool. I'm fine. Okay. I'm cool with that. And then what do you want to do for store credit for those two guys? Uh, probably 500 bucks. Store credit 500? Yeah. That makes sense. I'm down for that. Okay. Uh, and so before he brought these in, because he wasn't going to get a truck and bring... A 30 of these we agreed i'm paying them 150 bucks a piece for these right. so times 30 is 4500 dollars. so this was already established this is all new that i'm doing 500 trade so now we're at five thousand. well how are we no, working it out well it's going to be well the other one's cash we're doing partial cash partial trade on no, this one. No, not partial trade. It's we were worked it out that you're the, right, right for the, the yeah the right, right yeah yeah. So it's this is called cash that way. It's, yeah, no, it's the same yeah. to me because okay. it, it's got to go out. You're not right. getting it here. Right, right, right. So, right. so that means it's five grand. Oh no, that's trade. Never mind. Yeah, yeah. 500 Forty-five, five hundred, and then twelve hundred. Twelve hundred in cash. Right. Correct. Right. right. So that's forty-five. That's five thousand seven hundred in cash, basically. Right. And these cards are much more delicate than so here, here's this, the standard. Yeah, yours is almost in mint condition. Yeah. Yeah, so what this that, one, what that grade? an 80. 80? It's just real hard on these Well, the cards, are, like, cards. I was just saying the cards are so thin. Yeah, the, but see, my bubble came back at a 75. But I mean, it, it displays oh, incredibly well. But yours well. is punched too. Mine is munched. Yeah, oh yeah. 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 Hundred, maybe a hundred. hundred bucks. <laughs> Triple your money. But no, I, I have my money. I I picked up most of because th those are my personal, so yeah, I don't really sell much. No, that's why rated I, need to, in the I shop. need to talk to you about this. Oh yeah. Because, uh, yeah. No freaking idea, because of course it is eBay. You can literally list anything for any price. And I'd save it. I would. I'd uh, sell. Let me get you the because it's a key piece. Yeah. 